year, but especially for our ladies with crowns. This morning, Miss Alabama 2019, Miss Tiara Pennington joins us on Studio 10 to talk about Miss Alabama. It's coming up in just a couple weeks. Tiara, good morning to you. Good morning to you. Now, fun fact, Tiara is actually Miss Alabama 2019, like I said, but with COVID-19, you had quite the year. So you were actually Miss Alabama for two years. Tell me about that experience. I mean, it has been the greatest experience. This has always been a childhood dream of mine to one day be Miss Alabama, to walk the Miss America stage, and to get to do all of that amazingly on the first year, but then to get another extra year has been just incredible and something that every Miss Alabama wishes that she had that opportunity because a lot of us, we say, just at the time that we think we have figured it out, all of this being Miss Alabama, it's time to give it up. So. I've had the opportunity to be virtual Miss Alabama, in person Miss Alabama, going on my second year, and I've enjoyed every moment. And we are so proud of you. She has been an incredible Miss Alabama during one of the hardest years ever. So we do want to talk about Miss America too. You competed in that massive pageant. How much fun did you have? And you were actually in the top seven, am I correct? That's correct. I mean, once in a lifetime experience to get to compete with some of the most amazing women from all across the country. And so getting that opportunity to have fun with them. My roommate was Miss South Dakota and we still keep in touch to this day because we wanna both be attorneys. We want to both continue on when it goes to law school and she wants to go into politics. So I keep up with her all the time. And it's just amazing to know that I have friends in every single state, which is pretty cool. And we say, and we've been keeping up with each other, that as soon as this is all over, we need to have a big trip with all of us because I miss seeing them. And they've just done an incredible job of also representing their states during this tough time of living during a pandemic. And I mean, getting to be compete at Miss America, my judges, some of them were Kelly Rowland, from Destiny's Child, Karamo from Queer Eye, and also another fabulous actress from Superstore, which is a great show on NBC. So having all of those experiences are just moments that I will never forget. And having my name called out for a second time to be a top seven finalist was just icing on top of the cake. And the pageant was absolutely fabulous. You did an incredible job. So sadly, Thank another you. new Miss Alabama will be crowned pretty soon. All the girls head up to Birmingham. Birmingham Tuesday and then the pageants will start the week after. So tell me about the dates. If folks want to see it at home, you guys are still nailing down some of the details with that. Absolutely. We're still trying to make sure that we're doing everything as safe as possible. So right now there will be more information coming up very soon. So I would just ask everyone to keep up with the Miss Alabama official website for more information on tickets when they are opened to the public. So the public can come and watch hopefully, but the competition will kick off on June the 10th. The final will be on June the 12th and we will be crowning a new Miss Alabama. And so it's coming up really, really soon. Only 15 days until we crowd the Miss Alabama. That's right. So it all takes place at the Alabama Theater in Birmingham. We have a handful of girls from the Gulf Coast right here in our hometown headed up to Birmingham to represent their region. So Tiara, thank you so much for your service. Thank you for being a fabulous Miss Alabama. If people at home want to learn more information. Can they go to a website? Absolutely. Please go to www.missalabama.com and they can always email at missalabama.missalabama.com. So that's the email. They can go check all that information out and keep up with what's going on. All right, sister. Thank you so much. Enjoy this new season of life.